see how difficult it is for the vehicles to get in and how much traffic it holds up to try and get off of there. Right. Just, oh, that's a bit too narrow for it to get in there. You get chuckled, don't you? It's a blokey. Is he coming in here as well? No. Oh, hang on. Here's that tractor. I think that's that tractor coming back now, but no, it's not. It's different. Come back with a, a long trailer. Right? Yeah. Obviously, no number plates or nothing because that doesn't apply to them, does it? Now, you go about when you drive about with no number plate on or with no back lights or no brake lights. Oh, he's got oh, sorry, I tell a lie, he's got one brake light, and then you'd have the old bill after you, wouldn't you? But pharmacy would do they fucking like what I was saying. There's a byway that's the edge of the byway, and that fence there is the edge of the byway. When that big four wheel drive. Tractor coming here with the articulate, with the articulate trailer like on the hot lorry. He had to come nearly over to this fence to get the trailer around here. Well, I can't see it putting these stones here, making this narrower. Like I would say here. One, two, three meters, something three meters narrower. You're going up. Looks nice. Is nice. But it restricts the byway. Now, if you went outside your house and put some stones in the road or bollards in the road to keep your place or to keep people away from your house, you'd soon get them removed. But the Wiltshire Council seemed to... Um, let them do as they like. There was a problem here, oh, many moons ago. And it's quite ironic, really. I think I've said this before on here. It's quite ironic, really. But I've parked many a night over where those tires are, up on there. Now this road's laying here. I never noticed when I come down it. It had some stones over it, blocking it off. I don't know if they're still there. Yeah, they are. See it further on down? Can you make that out? Now, whether that's a byway or not, I don't know. But here it says, Police, this land forms part of a public highway. Any persons found camping may be removed by the police or the highway authority having regard to the relevant considerations. Now, they're all about what they've done now, about this new law. But it's all, um, it's always been here. These posts have been here, I would, I would estimate, 20 years. But I know for a fact they've been here 10. And that's because a load of the hippie, dippy, travelling, crusty, whatever you want to fucking call them, gypsy types came up here. But not real gypsies. And, um... They put the posts up. So nothing's really changed. But it says part of the public highway. Public highway. Which you can leave great big stones in. See, that's fair enough, isn't it? Access to be kept clear at all times. Now, by the look of that, I know he's been in there recently, but due diligence, you don't park anywhere where you shouldn't park, do you? Well, I don't. And um, when I usually park at night, I usually leave anywhere like this, I leave these lights on. Here you are. Back and front. So, 
because when you're if you weigh over three and a half ton you need to do this by law but i'm under three and a half ton but i could be over three and a half ton the same size i'm the same size if i had it up to three eight fifty instead of three five i'd be the same size van so consequently taking up the same size space so i want it safe anyway that's my little moan my little moaning groan and i'll put it up i'll speak to you later remember stay classy no fighting love you all bye bye and you skins